Hello and welcome to Flower Juice. My name is John McDonald and today I want to show you a really unusual arrangement and it's using some steel grass, some alliums, we've got some fresh teasels and I want to use some hydrangea just to base the design. But really the main thing about this design is the steel grass and what we're going to do with it. And it's nothing new but it's just fun to do so maybe you've not seen it before and it's worth having a wee look. So I've got this uh, mirrored sphere, this mirrored globe, and what I've done is I've just put some foam into there so we've got a base that we can work into. So if you take your steel grass, and it could be steel grass or it could be bare grass, it doesn't really matter, we place little sections of two or three stems into the oasis. So what we're really looking at doing is creating a circle really of these placements. So work your way around and just put them in at an angle and this is quite easy to do but straight away we're ending up with something that's quite big. Don't worry about that. And just keep going with your grass and then when you get the outer edge done you can start on a secondary one just inside. Now don't worry too much if you do three stems in one, two stems in another. If you've got three then that's probably ideal because they are a little bit brittle and they can break. So if you have only two and you break one you're going to be left a little bit. So this is looking pretty funky but get yourself some of this decor wire. Now this is the slightly thicker one. You can use the thinner one if you want um, if you use the thicker one you're going to see more of the actual wire and I'm just going to attach it to one of our units of grass. Now what we're going to do is we're just going to wind it round. So I've wound it round there and then bring in your next one and we just go along a little bit again. So what we're looking for is to create similar spaces here. Bring in your next one. And again we just continue. So this will just take a few minutes to do. Now the first time you do this you're probably going to go oh my god but actually it's really straightforward. And it can be quite quick. So the easiest way to do this or to have a go with this is get yourself some bare grass. It's relatively cheap, uh, it's a nice sized bunch, it's easier to work with if you've got short arms and then you can just have a wee play and once you get the hang of it you really can create lots of different shapes. So we could just continue around here and make a straight circle or we can actually get taller and taller. Uh, you could do one inside another. There's lots of different options. So I think what we'll do... I don't really want to go too, too big with this because the container's round, it's quite interesting in itself. And I think we don't want to get away from that. So we can come up a little bit. But this really doesn't take long to do. Now because you've got this on a wire, or with a wired design, you can actually manipulate it a bit as well. So we can go right to the end if we want. Now if I wanted I can, I can bring this right round and bring it to here. I could leave it so it comes out. I can really do different things with it. So maybe at the moment I'll just uh, wait and see how my arrangement goes and then decide how I do this at the end. So, our hydrangea. 
Now I've used Hydrangea a few times lately and I just, I'm not going to apologise because I love it and it's really good at the moment. So this one is a beautiful colour, it's really luminous. So we're just going to cut it into little florets and use that to base the top of the foam. So this would be quite a funky design for going on a table or for having it in the home. If you had a really nice big coffee table, then this could look amazing. And you don't need a lot of material with this. So we've created this quite simple. Now, our teasels. Really, I've not seen these before as a cut flower uh, in a green state. And so I thought this is really unusual and I want to use these. So we'll make a feature of them. And really we don't want to use a lot of material in an arrangement like this because what you'll end up doing is you'll end up hiding the mechanic that you've created. So you really want it to be quite transparent and quite loose and open. So just look at the way that these actually work, you know, the actual line in the stems and see how best you want to place them. But because your, uh, your spokes really are kind of radiating from a centre, then I think you want everything to radiate from the centre. So we're going to use our allium. And I'm just going to pop in quite low down. And then I want to put one further back. Now I'm just having my wee play with this. But I think I really like this just coming out. So I can use a little bit of wire. Just to secure that there. So, this has taken no time. It's only used three flowers, really, and some teasels and some grass. And there you go, just a very simple but really fun arrangement using just steel grass and a few simple flowers. If you've enjoyed our design, why don't you subscribe to our channel and you can keep up to date with all our designs. Thank you.